Okay, guys, I'm back. I don't know what's going on with YouTube, but it just cut me off like I don't know. But anyway, sorry about that. Like I was saying, um, I'm going to, I might put some of these on my Etsy because they're like bird, uh, bird trivia. And these will be like really cute for like nature journals and bird theme journals. Then I found this. This is so pretty. I bought two because I bought the only two that they had. And these, the original price in Vascoff's was $20.97. And I got it for real cheap. And they're uh, curtain tiers, but look at how pretty. Um, oh my gosh, what is that called? Oh my god embroidered the embroidering is so I got two of them the two that sets that they had it's so pretty and then the edging is gorgeous too so I used one for my kitchen uh, door window I have a little window on my door and then I'm using the other ones for journals because I think they're so pretty look at how gorgeous that is I love it. So cute. I love I love the detail on these. So I got those. And then Oh, and then I found this fabric. I'm not sure what project I will be using it for, but I definitely will be using it for something. I love it. I love the print, the roses. It's so cute. Look at how gorgeous that is. I love it. So I'll be using that for something. Isn't that pretty? Let's see. Um, oh gosh, then I found this. Uh, this was brand new also in the package. I just took it out of the package. I love butterflies and this is, it's butterflies. It's brand new, but look at the embroidered. It's like the, it's cut out. Let me see if I can show you. All the edging is like that. It's just so big. It's a shower curtain. And see the cutout of the butterfly? I want this for my, um, for my bedroom uh, bathroom, you know. But look at the edge. And I think I paid like $3 for this. It's brand new. And guys, I am not ashamed of uh, using thrift store stuff in my house. If it is in good condition and I love it, I will put it in my house. I love it. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? And it has like a ruffle as well. Uh, the, uh, balance. Let me see if I can show you the balance. Open the balance. How gorgeous. See that? So that is going in my shower after I wash it. Although it was brand new in a package, but I still wash it. Because you never know. It was probably in a basement or something, you know? Okay. Well, I'll talk about my machine. Then I found these. Look at these books. i never seen golden books like this. All of you guys have, but I haven't. Let me bring this up a little. Look at the golden books. There's three stories. I will do a quick flip through. Love these. So this one has the Pokey Little Puppy Animal Orchestra and the Fire Engine. And it's three in one. They're not old, but they're adorable. Look it. So you have all three stories in here. Look at the pokey little puppy. Isn't that cute? 
I got that one, and then the shy little kitten, the little red hen, and the the little red caboose. Mint condition, brand new. <laughs> That's super cute. And then the saggy baggy elephant, the sailor dog, and Scuffy the tugboat. I never seen them like this. I don't know if you guys have. The images are adorable. So I don't know if I want to keep these or I want to sell them. But anything that you guys see here, check back later on this evening because these are our copyright 2017. Because if I decide um to put anything on my website it will be on my website on my etsy by end of day today whatever i decide to list oh look at that look at that face so cute oh my god thank god that water heater stopped it's so loud i'm so sorry guys but this is where I have my crafty little corner in my laundry room. The Jolly Barnyard, Toodle and Tawny, Scrawny Lion. And I'm going to show you something else that is also um, Golden Book related that I never saw before. And then the Beauty and the Beast. I will be using this one, like I said, for the Disney um, journal that I am making right now. Some of this. Because I'm making a Disney journal. Uh, and then I found this and these I will be listing in the shop by end of day today and I'm going to list them in, in sets of 10 these are golden books and I think these came out for um, their 60th anniversary they're big um, they measure four and a quarter by six and Nine of them will be, good morning. Mm -hmm. Nine of them will be uh, identical with these. And then one will be different because I didn't have, uh, you know, I will be adding either the little cat or the scrawny, the scrawny, the tawny scrawny lion. So you have the little caboose. You have the little rabbit, the pokey little puppy. Uh, what does it say here? Great big fire engine, the little red hen, the, the pig, the duck, Scuffy the tugboat, the shy little kitten, Toodle, and the little rabbit. Did I, did I already say that? Yeah, I already did. So all three, I only got three that I'm going to list. All three are going to have those identical ones with the exception of one, two will have the color kittens and one will have the tawny scrawny lion. Okay, so that's the deal with those. So there's 10 per pack. I only got three. I wish I could have found more. But these are super adorable. Um, I found this book, Tough Plants, Unkillable Plants for Every Garden. It's super cute. Love these. Now for garden uh, journals and um, botanical journals. Now with spring, summer coming. So many images, so pretty. So I got that one. Oh, and then I found this. Forget Me Nots, a greeting card holder. And the reason I got it is um, <laughs> solely for this. You're going to laugh at me. On, on top of that, you know, you can cut these out and put them in journals because it's almost like a watercolor. See? 
Kentucky. But I like this. I'll show you. These are um, postcards. And then you can use these as... Uh, they're perforated. You can add, use these as... Uh, oh my gosh, bookmarks. And they're a little yellowed, you know, on the, on the sides, which I also love. I think these were from... 2000 but I love them because it's like almost like painted like a watercolor type deal so like I said anything and then these even these the papers are gorgeous below their pockets but the papers are decorated so I love them so anything that you guys uh, see here check back like on the evening and see if anything I listed. Oh, I found these old, these old uh, doilies or crochet uh, things. I'm thinking about doing a farmhouse uh, cookbook type journal. I actually just bought um, uh, Diane from Shawcraft One's uh, digital. Uh, kit that she just did with her collage sheets so pretty so I'm going to be using some of that I found this one and then I found this one I think this is going to be so good for pockets this one is really stained I don't know if I should try washing it or finish staining it up with coffee so that's and then I found the Wizard of Oz but it's a different Wizard of Oz. It doesn't look like the... This one is illustrated by Charles Santori. Let me see if I could give you a better look. Look at the images on this one. Let me see if I find a copyright on this. Copyright. 1991. 1991. So I love that. And then look at the front cover. Isn't that gorgeous? But look at the images. I love the images. Very different. Give you a, a little glimpse. It's gorgeous. I'm thinking if I was to keep this one, I would make a coffee table journal and use pages and use some of the pages for pockets and envelopes and tucks. Look at the lion, how cute. He's so scared he's crying. <laughs> The images are just amazing. Look at Dorothy, her house is flying. And some of the pages are like glossy, like that semi-gloss, and then but then some feel matte. I don't know. So that's gorgeous. Let's see. Then I found this one, Minikin, Midgey, and Moppet. It's a golden book. It says Look at how cute. And this one is copyright 1977. Ugh. Oh my God, how cute. If every mouse looked like that, I wouldn't mind having mice around ever. Look at that with her little bonnet. <laughs> so cute. I love it. Look at the butterflies. I'm obsessed with butterflies. Aren't those images so cute? So that's that one. 
Let's see what else I got. Oh gosh, I found this. This golden, the golden children's Bible, golden books. It is in excellent condition. And the copyright is 1993. I'll give you a flip through. And it's like, um, you know, it's a sign for the children to actually comprehend it. Because it has all the, glo the glo how do you say it? Glossary? Glo glossary? Oh my gosh. Listen, y'all. Don't make fun of my English. But it has all the stories. You know what I mean? Like an adult Bible is is different. Uh, this is for children. So the rise of Israel. And then it tells them the page. And then it tells them the story. It breaks it down for them. But I love it. And crucifixion. And Jesus and the disciples. And everything is illustrated. You know, because children like to look at pictures. I like to look at pictures. <laughs> oh, Sam, Samson. So for this being 25 years, it's an excellent, excellent condition. It's perfect. Let's see what else I got. Oh, so this is another Disney one that my sister, my sister found this one for me. And I'm thinking because Thumbelina is in here, I'm going to incorporate this one on my Disney uh, junk journal that I'm working on. It's so cute because she wants uh, all kinds of Disney characters in the journal. It's a lot of fairies in here. And then I have a glor what? Glorious Country. And I got this one because, like I said, I'm thinking about making that uh journal like that country recipe journal i love that this is not a good for me a good book for me to look at because i am currently on a diet and this is making me hungry yum but it's so pretty. I love like the country feel. Ugh, how pretty. So that is it guys. That is all that I got. Thank you so much for watching guys. And um, I think I'm going to record some process videos. Um, once I start on this uh, Disney junk journal. Um, let me know. Uh, if you guys would like to watch some process videos, give this video a thumbs up if uh, if you liked it. And if you would like to see me um, record some process video, that way I know that you do want me to do that. And yeah, thank you for hanging out, guys. Talk to you soon. Bye. Have a great day.